Good morning, little pirates! Okay, so we are going to be returning to our story, The Pirate Quencher, today. Right, so we had got to this point here in our story, and the pirates have been told by the fiddler that they can go, he will help them find some treasure. So we left the story as they were getting back onto their boat, which is the big pirate ship, to go off and find the treasure. Let's find out what happens next. Here they are. So off they sailed across the sea, and as they tucked into breakfast, the old fiddler began again. There is one small thing I forgot yesterday. There's also a monster, or so they say. He likes to eat pirates who come for his treasure, and he chews up their ships all for good measure. You scurvy sea dog, bellowed Captain. It best would be me, up or oh, monstrous. It's no match for me. I'm Captain Purplebeard, scourger of the sea. He doesn't seem too worried about the fiddler's warning. And the fiddler said, Oh yes, I agree, he doesn't scare me. Though no bones about it, he's a big old beast who likes nothing more than a pirate feast. He can swallow whole ships in his well poor jaws, though they say he's allergic to scarlet macaws. Hmm. There are rubies and diamonds the size of balloons. S but grab it all quick, or he'll have your entrails. Now fiddle dee dee, let's spread those sails. But no one moved. The crew looked around in fear and dread as visions of monsters filled their heads. Mm. And this is going to be your challenge for today. I would like you to create a sea monster. Okay, so you can let your imagination go wild. Create me a sea monster. Some of the pirates have been thinking about what this sea monster, the fiddler, is warning them about might look like. So I'll show you the picture here in the book where you can see some ideas. So this guy down here, he's thinking of one with lots of eyes. He's got one, two, three, four eyes. He's got big sharp teeth and he's got spiky head. Got this one here who looks a bit like a giant crab. He's got lots of arms to grab with. This one is a bit like a lobster, his big claws. And we've got another one down here again with lots and lots of eyes. This one's got, I think, five eyes. One, two, three, four, five. And he's got these up here. And he's got a big scary mouth. He's a bit like a big caterpillar Ooh, coming out of the sea. The monkey's not too sure what's going on. Look, it's just, I don't know. So... That's your challenge then, boys and girls, for today. I want you to design a sea creature that you think Captain Purplebeard might come across in our story. Okay, give it a draw, post it below. See you soon. Bye!